So I was wondering, so you know um, you're saying about the Jews not being not being Unitarian? Yes. So what about, so obviously those Jews that at, in Jesus' time, they came along because of the, um, uh, Jerusalem was destroyed. So because they had to come up with something to like, you know, like fix the problems that they had. But would you say that in the time before um, uh, the Babylonians came, and the uh, you had the kings in Israel and the priests. Would, it, would, I, would I, the kings or priests have thought that God was more than just one God? I think it, you know, there's no thinking about God being more than one God. You know, that's not what I'm saying is on the agenda. Right. I'm saying, but of course, there could be a real diversity of views. There's, there's, there is evidence that Jews, Jew, when the Jews mixed with the Canaanites, yeah. there, there, had been corruptions of religion and we know that because there are complaints about you know do not worship the balls do not have the high places and all this kind of stuff so we know Jew in the Jewish population the Hebrew population there was a diversion away from you know monotheism but, yeah. the, but the gen but the official religion the state religion if I put it that way that was monotheistic but monotheism is not the monotheism of Orthodox Jews of today or of Muslims of today. That's Unitarian monotheism. I'm not saying it's Trinitarian monotheism, because that will be a more developed, um, systematized um, doctrine as we Catholics have. I'm just simply saying that they're not um, Unitarians. They're, it's a richer thing. And, and as I said, I was saying to Victor, the work that's been done academically um, in recent times, looking at what Jews believed, shows that this, this, it is false to say that you can project back Unitarianism from today into first century, uh, the first century of Jesus' time, or possibly even back to before the um, Babylonian conquest. Yeah, but the, what happened in those times is different from what happened in Jesus' time. They believe yes. that. Because yes. it, in those times, they still had the priesthood. So. Yes, but it, I, I was saying that even if you go back to the, before the Babylonian conquest, you could still say that their, their concept of God was not strictly Unitarian. Because I was reading some verses to Victor from, say, Genesis and Judges, where you can see this figure, the angel of the Lord. I think um, St. Justin Martyr wrote about this angel of the Lord to show this is not, there wasn't even strict Unitarianism in the time of um, ancient Israel.